Hi guys, this is Daniel from FND. In this video, I'm going to show you how to place an image inside a text. You can also try this method in Photoshop. Let's get started. Add the image to the GIMP that you need to place inside the text. This is the image I'm going to place inside the te text. Then create a new white layer. White layer. Now select the text tool. And write it down whatever you wanted. Choose the font of your own but the font that, you ha that have bolder letters or most recommended to get the most part of the image inside the text so I'm gonna use Arial heavy font now click on the eyeball of this white layer to make it hidden and drop down this opacity of this text layer to 50% Now increase the size of text using this upper arrow in the tools option. Now move the text using the move tool and place it in the position that you need to get inside the text. Again, I'm going to increase the size of the text. You can also increase the size of the individual letter by selecting the letter and Press the upper arrow here to increase the individual size of the letter and you can also change the spacing between the letters making this opacity back to 100% and you can also increase the spacing increase or decrease the spacing between the letters by selecting the letter and Use this down arrow to move this R word to the left left position and this upper arrow to the right. And you can also change the baseline of this selected text text by using this upper and down arrow. After doing this, I am going to give some drop shadow to the text by going to script hyphen spoo and layer effects and drop shadow. Change the color to gray or whatever you want and click OK. And make this white layer visible. Then draw uh, merge down this text layer to the drop shadow layer and again this layer to the white layer. Then select the select by color tool and select the text and press delete button at your keyboard and that's it and you got the image inside the text. Additionally, you can fill the background color with the colors you wanted, change the foreground color to the color you wanted or you can also select the color inside the image and with the help of the bucket fill tool, 
fill it with that color so that's it guys thanks for watching uh, if you like this video thumbs up this video make sure to subscribe this channel for more tutorials see you later bye